say goodbye to the tiresome routine of sending countless follow-up emails that yield zero results. In the first video of our series, we showed you how to create and send personalized videos through Dove that grab your prospect's attention. But that's only the first step. By the end of this video, you'll have a powerful tool to take your follow-up strategy to the next level, close more sales and deals than ever before. Today, we're taking it a step further with our guest, Jamie Bricko from Insurance Centers of America. He'll be revealing the secret to revolutionizing your outreach strategy by using analytics, AI, and a teleprompter to improve your video and optimize your campaign. All right, let's start with the basics. When you send out personalized videos, you wanna track who watches them and for how long. This data will help you to determine which prospects are engaged and interested in your product or service. So usually when you come into Dub, first page looks like this. You wanna be able to go in and look at the video that you sent so that you can check out the analytics. The way that I do that is I click right here on the video icon and then you find the video. I sent this particular video to Sarah. So I'm gonna click on the video and that's gonna show me some analytics. And so the first thing that I see here when I open up this video is I can see these little icons here and there's one that says watches. And I can see that Sarah watched at least a portion of the video. Now, an important thing, it shows that she only watched 12% of it. It's only a minute long. So that means she only watched the first few seconds. So obviously there was something that caused her to, to stop watching it. With this information, you can then adjust your follow-up strategy. But how do you get them to watch 100% of the video? That's where AI comes in. By analyzing the data from your initial video, AI tools can suggest changes to your script that will resonate better with the prospects. These tools use machine learning algorithms to analyze factors such as tone, cadence, repetition, fillers, and professionalism to give you feedback on how to improve your delivery. This can be incredibly useful, especially if you're not used to being on camera or giving presentations. For example, if you notice that most prospects drop off after a certain point in your video, or if you see that a certain word or phrase is consistently used like okay, but, like, um, so, and so on, you can use AI to help improve your script. From this screen where I showed you that you can go into the video and actually look at the analytics, you've got the AI tool that is actually right here on this same page. It's on the dashboard of dub.com, this platform that we're using. And so you can see here, it says AI Assistant powered by Ira. And this is where we can then start to put different information in. We can choose from this drop down. In this case, we wanna do a video script. And then the industry, obviously, insurance, because that's what we're pushing. So the better the topic here and the more descriptive that you are with the topic on exactly what you want the script to say for you, and the better the result. Now, here in the dub tool, after you put the topic in, you can actually choose different tones that you want to have in the script. And they'll, they'll be reflected in the script when you read it. And I chose concerned, empathetic, encouraging. You can kind of play around with this and choose the things that you want to use. Then here I can decide, you know, how long I want this to be or how short I want it to be. And in this case, I don't want it to be very long. So I chose about 159 words. You can slide this up and down and it'll change the words. And then you hit submit and it pulls up your script. And in this case, because I asked it to be a video, it's actually giving us different things like, you know, use an empathetic tone, um, use an encouraging tone in, in between. And so it's written a script. Now, what I can do from here is I can actually take this script and I can copy the whole entire script just by simply going right click after I highlight it. I can copy it and then I can go over into a script and I can add this in as a script for me to use. So the cool thing is when you use a teleprompter, which is a great tool, it helps you to stay on script because when off script, that's where you start to use the ums and the so's and those filler words that I talked about that uh, can be distracting to the viewer. 
and then to get it into a teleprompter, you can get there a few different ways. But the way that I like to get there, which is really easy, is just by going to this record uh, icon here. When you click on that, it takes us to the video page where you can actually start to film your video. And you can see up here at the top, there's a search select teleprompter script. When you hit the drop down, you can actually, now that I've copy and pasted that script, I can just click on create new script. And it's going to allow me to copy and paste that script that I just, that I just copied right into here. And it's going to put the script right in for the teleprompter. You know, obviously I'll name it and, um, and then save it. It'll tell me that it's saved. And now when I go to film this video or record this video for Sarah, when I click on this, and again, I have the teleprompter script drop down up here at the top, um, I'll be able to find that script. I named it Sarah. I click on it and you can see that it puts the script right in here automatically for me, copied and pasted in. There's some really cool features in here that allow you to customize this teleprompter so that it works for you and your cadence and the speed that you're reading at. And so there's a slider down here at the bottom that shows you, okay, right now it's set to 122 words per minute, which is pretty, pretty slow. You might wanna speed that up a little bit, but what you'll wanna do is just test this and you can test it by just hitting this scroll button here. You can see how fast it scrolls and you can read it and practice and get it to a speed that works for you so that your delivery is clean and on point and professional. There are some tips that are helpful when using the teleprompter. As you can see from this uh, screen, it puts the script up pretty close to the camera. Um, I'm using a laptop right now and it's just a couple inches below the camera. And so what you wanna do is you really wanna make sure, and, and this will be part of the practice part, as you're reading your script and testing the speed, you wanna make sure that you can periodically look up at the camera, even though you're reading, so that you can show the prospect, you can show the person that's viewing this, that you are keeping eye contact. That eye contact is huge, very, very important. So now you've got a script that keeps you on point, and then you've got the, the camera to be able to really connect with the, with the prospect. Now that we've done all these things to improve our video, we've used AI, we've used a teleprompter, we've put together a really good video. This is one of the ways that we get this video to the point where we can start to see 100% of our videos viewed. This is the time to reach out with a personalized email or phone call to discuss the next steps. Finally, it's important to remember that not only what you say, but also how you say it can impact your outreach strategy. If you are interested in the Producer Investment Program with Insurance Centers of America, you can go to our website at www.icainsuranceagents.com and you'll find all of our information there. Can't wait to talk to you. So there you have it, using analytics and AI to optimize your video follow-up strategy. By tracking engagement data, using AI to improve your script, and grading your delivery with AI tools, you can create personalized videos that resonate with your prospects to help you close more deals. Thanks for watching, and be sure to give us a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you don't miss another video from Advancing Insurance Professionals.